A day after the school shooting in Texas, groups gathered in downtown Bend advocating against gun violence. Noah Chast met with them and a group trying to get a gun safety measure on the November ballot. Noah? Well, Lee, the message from both groups is pretty clear. Children should never be at risk of getting shot and killed while in school. But unfortunately, here we are. Now they want action in the form of background checks and ammunition limits. Are you a registered voter? Uh, yes. yes. Seal Larson is the head of the Peace and Justice team at First Presbyterian Church in Bend and a member of Lift Every Voice Oregon, the statewide group made up mostly of current and former pastors, advocates for mandatory background checks, safety and training, and 10 round ammunition limits for gun owners. Because within minutes, hundreds can be killed. And that just doesn't make any sense. They're at the Bend Library gathering signatures for initiative IP17. If the group gets 140,000 by July, the Reduction of Gun Violence Act will be on the November ballot. They've been at it for four months and have gotten mostly positive feedback. People have been very, very good. I, there's very few people who turn us down or who, who feel like it's not a good idea. We have a petition that would stop gun violence or I reduce like to it. Sign it. <laughs> sign it more than once. Okay. Are you interested? Yeah. Just sign the way you vote. Okay. Are you interested in signing? Yeah. Great. At this point, Larson isn't sure what first inspired the initiative. So it's not one particular shooting, it's all of them. It's again and again and again. And while Lift Every Voice had been planning to gather signatures for a few days, Moms Demand Action is just down the street and much more of a direct response to the shootings in Texas. I'm angry. Um, it's hard to be a gun violence prevention advocate and watch this happen over and over. Brandy Steelhammer is the Central Oregon leader for Moms Demand Action. She's lost five people to gun violence, and she wants people to know change is possible, but it could take some deep reflection. We can fix this if we want to, and we need to take a really hard look at ourselves and ask us why we don't want to. Why are we not fixing this? Brandy supports background checks for every gun purchase. Tonight we're asking if there should be a ban on assault rifles. To weigh in, head over to our web poll on the KTVZ.com homepage. Look under the drop-down menu. And you can find more information on the IP17 initiative on our website.